Hello Reception, welcome to your lesson today. Now today we're going to be doing a little bit of literacy but also a little bit of communication. So using your words to explain something, okay? Now because we've been learning about space, so um, one of our stories was how to catch a star. And then this week our story is Good Night Space Man. We are going to start by singing a nursery rhyme together. And the nursery rhyme that we're going to sing is one that I know that you all know very well because we've sung it in school. It's Twinkle Twinkle. So reception, together now we're going to sing Twinkle Twinkle. So I need you to get your hands ready and we're going to sing together. Here we go, ready? Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Okay, did you join in with my singing reception? Fantastic. Now, that was a nursery rhyme. And we know lots of nursery rhymes, don't we? So we know Twinkle, Twinkle. We know, what other ones we know? We know Bar Bar Black Sheep. We know Five Little Monkeys. We know lots of different nursery rhymes, okay? And today your work is gonna be all about your favorite nursery rhymes, so listen closely. Okay, reception, so your task for today is to think really carefully about your favorite nursery rhyme, okay? So what is your favorite nursery rhyme? There are so many nursery rhymes and I'm sure that we know lots of them. Mums and dads, I have sent you in the email a little link to a BBC website which has loads of nursery rhymes on it and it also has a little video for the children to watch. So just in case the children need a little bit of reminding about um, what their favourite might be, you can go on that website and um, show them some of the videos. And I want you to choose your favourite nursery rhyme, okay? So listen to a few and think, mm, which one do I like best? You might already know, but if you don't, think which one do I like best? And then once you've decided which one you like best, I want you to say, my favourite nursery rhyme is, so my favourite nursery rhyme is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, okay? So my favourite nursery rhyme is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star because I love the actions that you get to do with it, okay? So it's my favourite nursery rhyme because I love the actions that you get to do with it. So Twinkle Twinkle Little Star is my favourite nursery rhyme because of the actions. And then, once you have said which one is your favourite nursery rhyme, I want you to perform it, okay? So I want you to listen to the song really carefully. You might need to listen a couple of times. If you don't know the words, listen a couple of times. And then I want you to try and perform it yourself. So I want you to sing it to your mummies and daddies. Sing the nursery rhyme. And then I want you to come up with your own actions, okay? So if you were to choose a nursery rhyme, for example, um, the animals went in two, then I want you to come up with your own actions. You know when we did Twinkle Twinkle and we did the hands, I want you to come up with your own actions or maybe a dance to go along with your nursery rhyme, okay? So that when you perform your nursery rhyme, you're going to be singing it, but you're also going to be doing some actions or maybe a dance with it too. That's your challenge today, reception. So choose your nursery rhyme, tell your mummies and daddies why it's your favourite, and then perform it by singing and doing some actions or a dance. But you might have to make that up yourself if the nursery rhyme doesn't already have some actions with it. I'm so excited to see what you do today. I'm really, really looking forward to this, to seeing what you come up with. So mums and dads, if you could record the children performing the nursery rhyme, and then you can put it on tapestry. That's probably the easiest way to do it. Um, and then if the children, when they tell you what their favorite nursery rhyme is and why, if you could record that too, if not, if you could just write that down for me and then email me what they say, just so that I can make sure they understand um, the communication side of it, of saying it is my favorite because, and then giving a reason why. So if you could then email me what they say and then take a video of them performing their nursery rhyme. Good luck, reception. I hope you enjoy your lessons today. I think this is quite a fun one. So I hope you enjoyed this today and I can't wait to see what you come up with and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.